Hi, welcome back to Big Cat Homestead. Today I will be planting cold crops. These have been ready for quite some time, but because of the crazy weather, I held off on planting them and I just kept them watered and in a cool place. So today's the day. Let's get to planting. Here's what we're planting today. So I'm gonna take them and put them in the wagon and get to planting. Broccoli, collards, cabbage, kale, heading cabbage. All right, let's pack this stuff up and get going. All right. Here we go. I've been waiting because last year I planted too early and a lot of my stuff went to seed. So I think this is the perfect timing for the cold crops. Here's where we'll be planting. Let's get this sorted out. We've got one, two, three, four, five beds, maybe six. Okay, this is the first bed that I'm going to plant. This is Bonnie's hybrid, and you want to do them about two feet apart. You might go a little bit closer than that. And another thing is you want to mulch these. Once I get everything planted, I'm going to mulch because last year my broccoli especially kept going to seed because the roots were getting hot. So if you mulch them, it'll keep the roots cool. I'm gonna fill in this back end with these are called Morris Heading. Morris Heading Collards. I never had these before. Always have your labels because these things will look a lot alike. This is actually two. I'm gonna have to separate that. This is gonna be tight fit. I gotta maximize my space. That's what we're gonna do. So put one there, one here. These are, it's very easy to plant. Try 
trying to keep from where the water is at. There's two in here. Wow. Hope they make it. The head and cabbage collards and the cabbages are done. Here are the cabbages. Mulch. Okay, this bed is gonna be the broccoli bed. We have green magic and lieutenant broccoli. I'm gonna fit 12 broccoli in this bed. Again, it's a tight fit. You probably really would only put nine, but I'm just using the space that I have. Green Magic Broccoli. All of these recommend about two feet apart, but just use the space you have as close as you can to that recommendation. mystery ones here. We'll find out together what these are. Actually this is green. these the broccolis bok choy and kale Let's knock this out This is curly kale. Six of them. Still mulching, gotta finish mulching over there. Curly kale and bok choy. This is the collard bed. This is the before. 
beautiful. Okay, these are collards and we're gonna go up to here. Baby, hold it close down. Cover all of that up. And that's it. I'm gonna do every single one just like that. And then we'll mulch it. This is the collards here. Ronnie's Choice. Stick that there. Always have your labels because you're not going to know what's what unless you've been doing this a while and you really know how to recognize plants. A lot of the brassicas look the same. And then the greens. The leaves usually look pretty much the same. the collars all in and now we're doing the mulch make sure you mulch all your vegetables this is six collars see how big they get collard greens Okay, we have cauliflower here. I'm gonna take off this bad leaf. Okay, here's cauliflower. Already got the mulch there, so I'm gonna dig down in the mulch and put it in there. There we go. And I have six cauliflower. So I'm gonna plant them all in here. One there. Put another one here. Center. Want to put one there. One there. One there. So we'll knock this out real quick. This goes very quickly. I'm gonna go from here down. Very easy to do. Get your kids involved. Put your label in. Always have your label. Let's go finish these other ones. This mulch is going to keep the roots cool and that should help in bolting. So, with the crazy weather, it still could happen, but this is the best chance against bolting is heavy mulching. Take this off. This one's a little sad. Get all that mulch around there. There we go. All right. That's sweet. That's it. Oh, I got one more. <laughs> all that stuff up. That mulch around there. It's the cauliflower, all mulched in. Got some rosemary right there also. Brussels sprouts. Jane Cross. This is artwork. Plant this here and we'll come back. Here's where I'm going to plant them. Four in this container. By the way, four in that container. That's what they're getting planted. Okay, the Brussels sprouts are planted. And I took off these bad leaves. You see any bad leaves? It's okay to take them off. Here are the Brussels sprouts mulched. I hope you enjoyed this content, and if you did, please like, subscribe, follow, and share. Thank you for watching. Bye!